What the hell am I doing again? It's been so long. Uh, well, you know what? The, the, this should help. We're looking for the queen bee. That's right. We're, we were attempting to find the queen bee. Man, I can't see shit. This is a blind playthrough? Oh, obviously I can't see a fucking thing. Duh. But yes, this is a blind stream. I have... I mean, to say I've never played Terraria before is humorous with the 19 hours in the game I currently have. Uh, but I'm sure many of you Terraria players will hear the words 19 hours and, and scoff. Holy shit! Is that a blueberry pie? Oh no, it's some random. Oh, hey, I got coffee, yummy. I'm actually drinking a very light coffee right now. Starbucks millennial, that's me. I accept it. I'm aware Starbucks coffee is burnt and all kinds of bad, but it's what I, what I drink. It's like saying, don't you know that eating Taco Bell is bad for you? Like. Yeah, fuck off. Literally just get a coffee machine. You, you, you fucking itlet. Do you think people who go to Taco Bell want to hear, bro, just get, just like make your own tacos. It's so easy. It's cheaper too. We, we fucking know that. We fucking get it. D obviously. I didn't- I didn't go to Taco Bell because it was- uh, it was the cheaper option. Starbucks is worse than ta ta Taco Bell because it doesn't have Baja Blast. Baja Blast is mid. You all just like it a lot because you're sugar addicted fucking Zoomers and you spend- and the internet tells you Baja Blast is good. For the same reason you hate Nickelback because the internet told you so. Baja Blast is mid, super overly sugary trash. You know what? You know what? For the for the for the people who didn't watch the Adeptus Ridiculous episode because you don't watch Adric or anything like that, totally fine. Double stuffed Oreos are inferior. Regular, regular Oreo is the perfect amount of Oreo cream. The regular Oreo is the better one. Double stuffed is bad. It is an inferior product. More cream is not better, okay? More cream is not better. The right amount of cream is better. And regular ass Oreos are the peak. You got, you did not have, you, 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 you fat. You fat fucks. You, I'll, I'll double stuff your mom's ass. I don't like Oreos. Okay, that's unacceptable. I'm timing you up. We can debate the the, the type of Oreos and that kind of thing, um, but but we, we, we re I refuse. I refuse to debate the enjoyment of flat out Oreos. It's like we can we can debate all day. Okay, what's the best root beer? Mug root beer, A and W root beer, Barg's root beer. We can debate that all day. But if you say I don't like root beer, I'm shooting you in the head. Jesus, Berkey is choosing violence today. I finally quit caffeine for the most part. So like, I'm feeling pretty great not drinking coffee. But for today, because it's just a long day and, I, and I'm very tired, uh, I decided to get myself actual caffeine and it's in my system now. And I'm fucking ready. I'm fucking ready. I have caffeine like maybe once a week now. And now I'm like, I'm, I'm ready to, to strangle people. You know, I'm ex it's exciting. I can't wait to commit murder. Check stream chat. Oh God, why am I? Why am I checking stream chat? This is my threat. I'm recording it tonight. Oh no. Oh, that's a war crime. That's... That's like... Okay, real quick, for one, the lighting hitting the abs, peak. Peak stuff right there. Um... But like, th like, I think the CDC is going to come after you for making a biological weapon. Uh, next stream, I'll uh, I'll check in on you and see if you're, you know, fucking dead. So, so chat, I'm I'm seeing this image right here. I'm seeing this image, 
and I'm assuming this is probably the right, a pretty good one to go by. So, I mean, unfortunately, we don't have what they all do, uh, but I can kind of assume with a few of them, um, like battle and archery and stuff and restoration, uh, etc. <laughs> the gender change potion? You know what? If only it was that easy. The gender fluid. The gender fluid. <laughs> Damn. Yes. That person wins. That person wins the day. Now that we're finally fucking done organizing mostly, um let's let's look at the stuff. Regeneration potion needs day bloom, mushroom and bottled water, and iron skin needs day bloom, lead ore and bottled water. Okay, I think we have those things. Uh, this, okay, here's Daybloom. And then we need Mushroom. And then we need Bottled Water, which we have 11 bottles, which means I'm assuming in order to get Bottled Water, you literally uh, just go to water and you, and you like right click on it. All right, now I need to look up how the hell to summon the, the Queen Bee. Queen Bee. All right, three hard mode boss, summoned by breaking the larva inside beehives of the underground jungle or by using an abomination anywhere within the jungle. Abomination requires five honey block, stinger, hive, and bottled honey. I have two stingers. I know I have five hive. There's two honey blocks right here, but I can probably get a few more. There's the 70 hive. Do I have bottled honey? I thought I did. But I might not. Okay, chat. I got a question for you. So I was at... Uh, when I was at TwitchCom, I met with a group that does large-scale manufacturing of all kinds of interesting stuff. We're talking, um, you know, we're, we're talking good old mouse, mouse pads. We're talking, um, we're to, lot, lots of stuff, lots of stuff, you know? Um, one of the things they do is plushies. What are our thoughts on a brickle plushie? I, I assume chat would say yes, because of course. Um, the question is, what are our thoughts on like like like? What are our thoughts on the size? Because I think we could definitely make like a like about this big, you know, like classic brickle plushie with the little feet. But I could probably have them do like like. A big one. Like like a, like a dog sized, you know? I so I was and I was also thinking, what if we what if we made you know you know how you have all the hats in chat? What if we made small plushy hats with like velcro that you can swap out for the headpiece, you know? I I was thinking about all these kinds of things, so um I thought that'd be kind of fun. Brick sized. I'm setting him in my next house. He will be in my wall. He will be in the walls. I'm sick of dealing with the crimson. So I'm going to, uh, I'm going to go ahead and, uh, and just not deal with the crimson. Are you enjoying the stream of me doing nothing but just digging beneath the crimson the horizontal elevator also called a tunnel well let's not be pedantic about it holy shit bricky your t-shirt's being corrupted by the crimson watch out ah! i wish i was strong enough to to tear it apart again i'm not i'm not i'm not powerful enough to just rip it apart you tore like four shirts on a particular stream yeah but i cheated they probably don't remember chat, but uh, when the shirt ripping stream happened, uh, you'll notice that every time I went to go rip the shirt, I left 
And the reason for that is just little, little, little behind the scenes, behind the scenes commentary for you all, you know, uh, was so I could take a pair of scissors and snip the tiniest hole right here. So if you noticed every single time I went to go rip the shirt, I specifically got one finger in in the hole and then did and then like I leaned forward like this and did the rip because because ripping these shirts just by themselves is very fucking difficult. These are these are meant meant to be very very hard to rip because they're like you know they're good quality. So yeah, I I don't I'm, I don't buy cheap shirts. It's actually quite see movie magic chat movie magic. Now you know. Did you know that the uh, the Avengers aren't actually real? Honey block stingers, bottled honey, and hive. La bomba. All right. This should be enough for the abomination. There it is. We can build two of them, just in case. There she, uh, there, I mean, there she is. Kind of thought there'd be music. Oh, I hear it now. So far, so good. You know? Like, I haven't reached stage two yet. But I've literally regened more HP than not. Are then lost. I mean, all she's doing is firing like a lot of bees at me, you know? Okay, she's getting a little faster. Okay, we'll pop a single healing potion. Does she even have a stage two? Besides getting like mildly quicker? Okay, yeah, she's just quicker. I expected, like, a difference in attacks. Well, that was incredibly easy. Wow. Yeah, yay, we did it. Uh, let's open up the treasure bag. Bee mask, we wild hive pack increases the strength of friendly bees. Honeycomb releases bees and douses the users in honey when damaged. Oh shit! I can become a I can become a bee uh, like summoner. Honey goggles summons a rideable bee mount. Hive one consumes high places. Hives bee shirt vanity item. Bee mask vanity item. Be wax as well. Damn! Let's go! Releases bees and douses the user in honey when damaged. This is an equipable, so I assume it's in the same spots as things like the boots and the and the band and all that kind of stuff. Oh, that's that's very difficult though, because I actually really like the idea of the wild hive pack as well, which is increasing the strength of friendly bees. But I need to wear them. I feel like I need to wear them both together, you know, in order to really get the prop, the the solid uh, combination. The honey gives you increased life regen, by the way. 
Oh. Oh, you mean the bottled honey, you mean. No, the effect from the hive? Why doesn't it say that? Why, does it, why doesn't it tell me that? The other one? Honeycomb. Releases bees and douses the user in honey when damaged. That still doesn't tell me that I, that I get regen. Why doesn't it say that? Okay, yeah, well, whatever. All right, it's fine. Whatever, whatever. All right, that's 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 really good, though. And what's the sword? Strong Beekeeper. 35 melee damage, 15% critical strike chance. What, holy shit. Wait, what? Very fast speed. Strong knockback. Summons killer bees after striking a foe. Small chance to cause confusion. 15% extra knockback. Wait, that's so good. And then it also summons bees. Which means, which get buffed by, wait, holy shit. I have to keep the boots. I'm sad that I have to lose the uh, band of regeneration, but oh my God. This is, this is a flat out better than my Ruthless Blood Butcher by, by a staggeringly high amount. Four gold's not that bad. Let's do it. Shameful beekeeper. Strong beekeeper. Savage beekeeper. Uh, I lost some crit chance, but uh, uh, that ain't bad. 10% damage size and knockback. We have our statues now. We have all of our blocks and all that jazz. Um... We need platforms. Oh, we have plenty. I'll bring some more wood just in case. And it's almost nighttime, too. Here we are. Okay. <sighs> Oakley Dokley, neighborino. Let us begin the creation of our Skeletor. Oh, my God. Of our Skeletor Arena. Here's the plan. The plan is I'm not really sure what the plan is, but these two things will be both here. Someone said if I press B, I use all my potions. Done. Bees are ready. I am making it through this one. I am making it through this one chat. I am making it through this one chat. Did not work. Did not work. Fucking, that's some damage. That that guy's got some damage. It wasn't too bad of a of a try. Um, Skelly Boy fucking hits. Wow. All right, I was not ready for that one. Uh. I tried, I tried dodging the, the arms. I tried using uh, the shield bash into the arms to stop me from taking collision damage. Um, but it, it didn't work as well as I would have liked. I could try killing the bee again. Seeing if I get anything useful from that. Yeah. 
I won't lie, the beast sword was fucking though. It was fucking. Let's hit all the potions and summon the bee. Ooh. Oh shit, I can literally just use the Cthulhu thing and run into her. Oh. That's easy as pie. Oh god, I got stuck. This doesn't do as much damage as I would have liked. I think I would have liked this to do a bit more damage. I'm stuck. All right, I got hit with it way more than I'd like right there as well. Oh no. Oh no, I might die. We're good. We're good. Made some mistakes there. Made some very bad mistakes there. Wasn't great. Could have thrown some bee grenades, could have done some honey. Was a little sketch. Was a little sketch. Um, that was a whole lot of oopsies right there. We got demonic the bee's knees, guarding hive pack, hive wand, bee shirt, and beeswax. Where I got the bee shirt. Okay, demonic bee's knees. Twenty-eight percent. Oh, it's a bow. Twenty-eight percent range. Uh, range damage. Eleven percent crit. Very fast, very weak. Wooden arrows turn into a column of bees. 30% damage, 5% crit. We need to make some changes here. Unfortunately, our changes include... Can I, can I like, remove the blocks beneath the tree? Shit. <sighs> okay, the tree is going to be a problem. I don't have any bombs. There's no bombs in my inventory besides the bee grenade. Yeah, I know I, know I have to, I know I have to cut down the tree, but I put my ax away because I'm a moron. Because I'm stupid, chat. We have the statue, we have all the stuff. We have the bees, we have the proper setup for arrows. Okay. Did that include the pie? It did. We need the Hornet Staff. We have our... We have our Hornet.
I forgot about the bee grenades. I need to dodge those skeleton attacks. I'm oh, it's a wall! I forgot it's a wall! the speed we learned how the skulls go we did it we're, we're fucking balling we're beeling that's stupid i'm sorry it's I'm, I'm very happy skeleton mask angry bone glove shoots crossbones at enemies while you are attacking plus three percent damage skeleton pack sucks But I can go in the thing now. Dungeon heist. Cobalt shield. Grants immunity to not back. I mean, that's kind of cool, I guess. Rope. But... That. Oh, hey there. Oh. I want the teleporter. You beat Skeletron using the bee's knees. You truly are Amelia Main. Okay, I know I'm going to need more than just the teleporter. I'm sure I'm going to need the wires and all the other stuff, but but allow me allow me a quick moment's stupidity. To, to get in here and loot the rest of the dungeon. Okay, there's a lot. There's there's much more in here than I thought there was going to be. Oh my god. Man, I just wanted the fucking side gig. This took me to a dead end. This took me to a dead end. Can I at least, can I, can I bomb it? No, I used the key already. No, the key's gone. I used the key. It was on an earlier thing and it gave me dick. I don't have another one. I, you, I, I used the key already. There's nothing here. Nope, nope. 
Fuck this place. Let me make that extremely clear. Let me make that extremely clear. Fuck that place. I got angry bone glove. You're the cobalt person, right? Yeah, you have the cobalt leggings. Here's the angry bone gloves and a skeleton mask for you. Chaz molding over no cobalt shield. I, I, okay, I don't know if I'm missing something, but the Cobalt Shield looks incredibly fucking mid. One defense immu grants immunity to knockback. You know, you know what? Where the hell is Wyatt? Obsidian Shield requires Obsidian Skull and Cobalt Shield. Grants immunity to knockback, grants immunity to fire blocks. Two defense. I don't... What is the importance? I'm not seeing it. There's a stage after that. Ugh. All right, I'm looking at the wiki. Cobalt shield. Cobalt shield becomes obsidian shield, which becomes a uh, shield. The hell does the uh, shield do? Grants immunity to knockback and fire blocks. Grants immunity to most debuffs. Oh, is it because of the most debuffs part? Oh. Well. Oh. So is chat trying to farm Cobalt Shield because they want the uh, shield and um, they don't have it and that's why? Uh, okay, yeah. That's boring. What's next? Craft a Molten Pickaxe. Defeat the... Oh. Wall of Flesh is the next one, huh? The master and core of the world who arises after a great burning sacrifice. So, like, I'm assuming he's in hell because core of the world and everything. Considering that I just barely survived Skeletor, I don't necessarily know if I have the ability to deal with, um, with the wall of flesh. I do not. I, I don't want to go back to the scary zone, to the spooky zone. I'll go back. Wait, okay, hold on, hold on. Teleporter, teleporter, teleporter. I, I want to figure out the teleporter thing, so at least the, te the, the travel will be less painful. Usage. Two teleporters to be transported between it must be placed on the surface of saw blocks or platforms connected by, connected by wire, along with the trigger mechanism. Here's activate all players. Do I need to connect? Okay, so I need a second teleporter. Lovely. Um, do I need to connect both across the map like like across the map but that means I need to talk to the person who does the oh. alright back to the dungeon I accept my pain and service the, the spiky balls are in different spots now. There's also a blazing wheel of flame. Does the dungeon fucking change? Oh my god. Oh, what the fuck is this? What the fuck? It's all breaking apart. You know, you know what's the most infuriating? Sometimes you'll start breaking through the invisible walls and they'll just end up like it just just ending with nothing. There's there's just nothing there. And oh and then and then and then there is a wall that leads to nothing that obviously looks like it's supposed to lead somewhere, but then doesn't. Okay. Just I'm good. I'm... This place sucks. This place sucks. I thought I thought the underground um sand area was bad. This place sucks. 
It is dog shit. Holy shit, the flame ball. There is a dungeon slime. I got a golden key, let's go, big pog. All right, there's wizards again. Quick Miramasa. It looks like a katana of some kind. The skeletons have arrived. God, I feel like the fucking Germans in World War One. You wizard trench gun using son of a bitch. Stop it. Stop it right now. Golden key. Okay. We have a golden box over here. Keen blue moon. This wizard. Shadow key. We need to find out where the um the shadow boxes are i suppose i oh my god Oh my god! I'm out of everything that could help me besides, like, I guess this Night Owl potion. Which will help a little bit. I'm just gonna sip it all. I had a sip of everything. This place just keeps fucking going! Oh my god. <laughs> what is this? Is that the end? This looks like the end. I'm basically in hell. Like... Like, this looks like the end. There's- there's probably still things I can- I can grab and- and- and random loot I can pick up, but... No joke, you have like the biggest dungeon I've seen, and you are only on a med world. Really? Like, cuz- yeah, cuz like, holy shit, dude! It's so fucking massive. Okay, I'm home. Um, I mean, the magic missile looks really good. The handgun seems pretty good. I don't know about the scepter. The Muramasa probably would be good if it wasn't... The, if the beekeeper didn't exist, because the beekeeper right now is just so good. Take the handgun to the guide? Alright. Why? what can this Glock get me? The Phoenix Blaster. Ten Hellstone Bars. Hmm. What about, uh, the Magic Missile? The Sky Fracture. Light Shard and Soul of Light. How about the Aqua Scepter? Not a material. Valor's also not a material. There's Knight's Edge, which is the... Oh. The Blood Butcher, Miramasa, Blade of Grass, and Volcano. We have the Blood Butcher and we have the Miramasa, so that's good. So we're on our way. Um, but we need the Blade of Grass and the Volcano to get Knight's Edge. Because I, th I think I saw that other sword that you guys talked about. What was it called? Eternity. And I was like, this doesn't seem that good. It seems kind of like meh. And then I realized, and then you were like, no, Bricky. No, 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 no. You do not understand. Or Zenith. Thank you, Zenith. Like, no, Bricky, you do not get it. You do not understand. You have not used it. No, 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 no. 
Well, okay, wait, so hold, hold on. Blade of Grass, Blade of Grass. We can do Blade of Grass. Um, let's get back to, let's get back to my, um, it's fine. Um, it's Jungle Spores and Stingers. I don't think I have any more Stingers left. There is the possibility it got placed in a different thing. Oh, wait, no, here we go. Oh, and here's a bunch more vines. Wait, so we're fine on those two. We're missing the spores, though. I swear to God, chat, this game, every time I'm ready to put it down, it, it finds a reason. It finds a way to pull me back. Ah, there's some. Jungle spores three. Oh, I see more down there. Nice. Uh, ah, down to the left. Now that I like, I know what they look like, it, it changes it up so easily. Dangerous blade of grass. 2% damage, 2% crit chance, 5% size. That's actually kind of, kind of great. Holy shit. Okay. Um, let's put you in here along with the bombs. Now I just need the hell items. Question for chat. Can I mine hellstone utilizing my current crimson pickaxe? The answer is yes. To hell! Okay. Here we are. Hell. The the worms in hell are a little different. Shadow chest. Annoying flower of fire. Ornate shadow key. Obsidian skin potion, restoration potion. Uh yeah. Etc. stuff, stuff, stuff. I'm assuming this red stuff is the hell ore I'm looking for. Hellstone. It is. Unfortunately, there is a lot of lava, but I got a, a lava... The obsidian skin potion lets me reduce it to uh, my, the damage I take from lava. Oh, no, it's immunity to lava. All right, we gotta start mining now. I mean, we can always go back down into the elevator if we need more, but I'm gonna get as much hellstone as I possibly can while I'm here. I got the potion. This is this is literally the entire reason I'm here now. All right, I'm gonna go enter that area over there. What the fuck? Oh, right, because of the gravity potion. Hell Forge. I forgot about the gravity potion. I know we need obsidian bricks as well, if I'm not mistaken. Wait, not the bricks, just obsidian? Oh shit, like the, the mixing water into them type thing. Like the classic case. Ah, crap. It might be time to return home. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Okay. That was pretty great. I must say, obsidian door, living gore, okay. Obsidian candelabra. Uh, oh, right, we got the hell forge now. Don't know what that gives me. Probably something involving hell. Let's go volcano. And then, now that we have Volcano, and then we have Miramasa, Dangerous Blade of Grass, and the Ruthless Blood Butcher. Oh, we need the Crimson Altar. Damn it, of course we do. Where's the closest one? Probably over here somewhere. Nah, the left is probably faster. We're going to the left. Damn you, Crimson Altar. Making me excited. And then immediately, immediately making me go somewhere else I don't want to go. Here it is. Oh my god. Knight's Edge. Deadly Knight's Edge. Hold on. Oh! 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 Deadly Knight's Edge, 10% damage, 12% speed. 
What's the what's the highest uh, best modifier is legendary? Oh, that's I mean that's a I mean that sounds like a good roll, right? Holy shit! I'm assuming after Knight's Edge, we probably get Zenith when you combine that together. Let's see what we got with Knight's Edge. Oh no, there's true Knight's Edge. Even okay, Soul of Fright, Soul of Might, and Soul of Sight. Oh goodness gracious! Well, now I gotta, now I gotta know what the where the hell you you get you get that. Soul of Fright. Dropped by Skeletron Prime. What the fuck? There's another one? Soul of Might. Dropped by the Destroyer. Don't know what that is yet. Soul of Sight. Dropped by the Twins. Don't know what that is either. Okay. Uh, alright. That's not great. Um, does, does True Knight's End turn into anything? It turns into the Terra Blade. Okay. And what does the Terra Blade turn into? And the Terra Blade turns into Zenith. Oh my god. Oh my god. I need Meow Mirror, Star Wrath, Influx Waver, the Horseman's Blade, Seedler, Star Fury, and. Three I actually do have. Beekeeper, Enchanted Sword, and Copper Short Sword. Those are three I actually do have. I love how you need a Copper Short Sword. Just a dinky little little piece of shit Copper Short, uh, short Sword in order to have Zenith. That's hilarious. Can I make Hellstone? <gasps> Wait. Damn it, I want the gear set so bad. But we shouldn't. But we shouldn't. <sighs> That's unfortunate. You know why? Well, because we should get the pickaxe first, right? We want the molten pickaxe first, don't we? Because we always do pickaxe first. Because you always get the pick, because then you can do the next thing. You know? Keen Molten Pickaxe. We have to be responsible. All right, chat. I think this is the time that we end. This, this is a good stopping point, don't you think? I feel like this is a great stopping point. The, uh... uh we, we, we killed the bee. We killed Skeletor. We went to hell. We did the dungeon. And we got Knight's Edge.